So one of the biggest things that we often discuss when it comes to running, specifically if you're gearing up for a big event like a marathon or an ultra marathon, is the ideal running weight of an athlete. And it is quite important because obviously the lighter you are on your feet, the more efficient you'll be as a runner and it will ultimately benefit you. But a lot of athletes try and lose weight simultaneously to gearing up their fitness uh, for an event. And often they do this too close to the event, which often leads to a energy deficit and it can lead to fatigue and also the inability to be able to recover after sessions. So I often advocate if you are going to be looking at losing weight, don't do it too close to an event. Try and do it way before you actually gear up your running for that particular event because you don't want to impact your ability to be able to perform in your training sessions. So obviously if you're not giving your body a enough energy for the energy system in order to be able to achieve those quality sessions, um, then you are going to be limiting your progress as well as impacting the recovery post-exercise and then you're going to be limiting your ability to adapt between training sessions. So very important. If you are looking at getting into an ideal running weight, start off way before the event and get into an ideal running weight before you actually gear up your training for that event. You don't want to go into a massive calorie deficit. You want to keep the calorie deficit as small as possible so that it's a bit of a weight loss over a longer period of time. And as you get closer to that event, you actually want to try and maintain an energy balance. In other words, giving your body exactly what it needs to be able to perform at its best. 